Kia ora koutou katoa, Associate Professor Tracy McIntosh. My area of research is women in prison, particularly Māori women in prison, and also looking at ex-prisoners, and largely there I focus on men who have exited prison, particularly those with gang associations. I'm particularly interested in looking at the intergenerational transfer of social inequalities. If we look at our prison situation in New Zealand, we have one of the highest incarceration rates in the world, and we also have one of the highest levels of racial disproportionality in the world. What this means is that we have this incredible waste of potential. So I'm working with people who I see as experts of their own condition to look at the reasons, the drivers for crime, and looking at the ways that we can stop that. I spend a lot of time in prisons, and I work with young people who in many ways are not very different from the students that I teach at the University of Auckland. What is different is that they have experienced high levels of social harm, often in their very early life, high levels of victimisation, and this, and many of them have then gone on to not only have suffered social harm, but then to perpetrate social harm. The loss of potential, the incredible levels of suffering that occurs in whānau, in communities, and indeed for the nation, is something that I think that we have, have to have a better understanding of, so that we can, we can work towards really culturally adaptive solutions. I believe that in New Zealand can actually show global leadership in this area. We have this, this ability to really look at social harm. We've got a whole range of ways that we can work in it. You know, some people are doing important stuff in the policy realm. Others like myself are working much more in the experiential realm. I spend a lot of time in prisons. I spend a lot of time with people who are reintegrating uh, back into the community and the huge difficulties that ex-prisoners face. And I work a lot with whānau. At the moment in New Zealand, 23,000 children, 23,000 children have a parent or parents in prison. The intergenerational reach of that type of statistic is incredible. As a Māori woman, the fact that our prisons are overpopulated, overrepresented by largely young Māori men and young Māori women means that I have a really personal interest in it. We often think about prisons as being a solution to a crime problem. I think that what my work and the work of many others really strongly suggests that in many ways the prison is around unequal sort of power relations in society, unequal distribution of the, the privileges that come in society. If we think about social harm, if we think about poverty, if we think about violence, we think about racism, a focus on social harm and the things that we can do to reduce social harm is a much better way that we can stop this pipeline into the prison. In fact, we had a Minister of Corrections who once said that we shouldn't talk about the prison pipeline, we should recognise that it's a sewer.